Chops here for the men's open pro shoot down at Fort Benning. The weather's a little gray, but hopefully the action will be hot. So far, we have Dan McCarthy in the lead with 434. Staff shooter for Chop Shot Archery, go Dan. We have Tommy Gomez at 432 in second. We have Tim Gillingham, another uh, staff shooter for Chop Shot, and last week or last month's winner at 429. And then Levi Morgan and Chris Hacker are tied at 428. So hopefully all these guys do really well and we'll get you some exciting coverage. All right, so while we're filming, we're also gonna work with a leaderboard. That's a new idea we came up with. We actually licensed the leaderboard to some other places that are doing filming. Uh, who maybe or may not be right next to us, but uh, we're going to show you the original leaderboard technology right now. This is how it all began. So uh, that's what we're going to get you guys today, and hopefully you can all keep up with some really accurate scoring. Okay, first up for Dan McCarthy. Going for the first a round is in the game, and we'll see what the scores are. We've got Dan the man up first with a five. That is unfortunate. Hopefully he'll get another one. Tommy Gunn is uh, shooting a black bear, or, I'm sorry, a brown bear that's a little bit further away. And here's, he got a 12, so here's the Tommy Gunn. Uh, we have the hammer up next. And we have one of Tim on the javelina. And he also got a 12. Good for him. Way to go. All right. We have the manimal on the uh, feeding deer, and he got a 10, unfortunately. So. And for Chris going for number 12, but uh, and Chris, the, Chris, the, Chris the Wacker for, Hacker for, uh, got a 10 as well. So just like we'll that, update we the leaderboard and be right back. Okay, as the leaderboard stands okay, right now, you can see we've some Morgan, movement in the first round. And, and we are going 12, to, uh, to 4, we're going to update that again in the second the round, and we'll see how they do. All right, we've had some changes here on the leaderboard. It's pretty exciting. Chris the Hacker Wacker got uh, a 14 and as you can see that has seriously changed the leaderboard uh, but uh, we're pretty excited and they're shooting now so we'll see how they do. Alright there's been a lot of changes. Uh, Our leader uh, now quite a bit of good shooting. Is Levi Morgan. The man is currently leading Dan 464. 464. Dan the man is in second. Is Tommy, Gomez and Tommy Chris Gunn and, and Chris the Hacker Wacker are tied for third. And the hammer is in fifth, but right. it's still a very close race. Arrows, and as you can see on the leaderboard, things are very hotly there. contested. So if they're ready for their okay, fourth arrow, here we go. If you're ready, we we'll start your one minute now. All right, we've got a lot of lead changes going on here. The leaderboard is right. in utter chaos. Now our leader is Dan McCarthy. It sounds like Dan McCarthy's pulled all the way back to the top, bringing the chops to the top. Tommy and Chris at 470, Tommy Gunn and Wacker Hacker tied for second. I think we're going to have everybody with uh, the Manimal. So and uh, who are we forgetting here? So Somebody else are still in the race. And uh, here yeah. is the leaderboard as it sits. They're shooting again. Here we go. Okay. Here we go. First up, Tommy Gomez in the county looking for a 14. Tommy Gomez says. Tommy Gunn just went for the 14. There's a 14 lot of applause. And he got it. Way to go, Tommy Gunn. Things are heating up here. Tim Gillingham, currently a 469. And he was shooting a cinnamon bear. 14 for Tim Another 14. Very exciting. Very exciting. You can hear the crowd go wild. Tim's now 483 for, for Levi Morgan on the high Havelina. He's looking for a 12. He Manuel did 12. get the 12. Things That's are very close. Board, you can four. hear the excitement in the crowd. Tied with Tommy Gomez. A 10 for Chris Hacker. Hacker did get a 10, so he's still in the running. Dan McCarthy are currently and up. Big Dan the Man 10 for Dan McCarthy. also got a 10, so everyone is staying tight. The crowd is excited. Even in the damp okay, weather, you can tell that people are still enjoying themselves. What a day. Okay, let's, let's see how they do on their final arrow. Medicine. All right, we're down to our final arrow. Everyone's going to judge and be ready to shoot in a minute. Just get everyone up to speed. So here is the leaderboard. I don't think I need to keep calling it out. You guys are following at home. So we're going to bring it in. As you can see, things are quite clearly laid out for everyone. And, uh, I think it's pretty exciting when it's this close. So we'll see who comes out on top. Here they go. Up right now, they're shooting at a alert 
here. He's looking for a 14. Going for the 14. Let's see what he does. Survey says eight. Oh, he got an eight. That moves him to four that's, uh, that's a tough shot. So Currently he's leaving we'll, four uh, points we'll right on the off field. Those. All right, we, next up, we have the hammer. Tim Gillingham, currently at 483. And will he go for a 14? Tim's, Tim's setting his sight Florida. because uh, he doesn't want to miss, and that's Tim a very Miller. important part of archery. He starts in one minute now. He's got one minute to shoot, and hopefully he can uh, get an arrow off. <laughs> it's close. <laughs> Let's see what he gets. He's going cut the tension say. with a knife. It's a... It's an eight. Oh, unfortunately, the hammer got an eight. Uh, four, uh, that's a good one. try. Sometimes that'll happen. Curly enjoys a one-point lead over Chris Hacker for first place. We've got Dan Man up right now. Next Let's up, see what Dan McCarthy. Do. Curly in four Seems like everyone is going for a 14 today, so we'll see what Dan decides and if he gets it. Right. <laughs> we'll start your one minute now. Attached to the string, sitting on a rest. He was a 14 yes. ring, and he's Dan the man got it. Good for Dan. It is very exciting here. You can tell the crowd is really pumped All right, up. This is a very simple mathematical problem. <laughs> Levi Morgan is currently 13 points behind. <laughs> Manuel's up, and it appears Ergo, that he's picked up a new sponsor, Oshkosh Bagash. As you can see from his wardrobe, he has uh, again, some overall the Gomez on. Uh, where we're from, high. those are generally reserved for ice fishing so, folks, and outdoor work. Watch, but, uh, you know, obviously we're outdoors, but usually in the winter, so. Now. Uh, we'll see. He's uh, really doing a good job of making it look good. You know, it kind of reminds me of the old days of uh, Criss Cross and the early hip-hop movement. So we'll see how he shoots. Go on. Oh, 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 oh. This is exciting. Good to see you can look good and still shoot well. Thank you, man. For putting on a clinic today. And we have Tommy Gunn up okay. next. Now, well, let's see what he does. Part well, about he this, go for a 14? I'm sure he has to at this point. All weekend, it just wouldn't go away. He blanked his first target this morning. He now is one arrow away from going to another arrow. Fortunately, the other announcer is reminding Tommy of his this is previous failures really today. All so right, hopefully Tommy, that doesn't get in his head. Is set. And uh, it's he all pulls yours. off a good shot. Survey says. Say. It looks like it might be just a little bit under. They're looking close, though. It could be on the line. Call the Proctor. He's still looking. Oh, oh, he got it! He got the 14! Now that is exciting. We'll have to wait and see where the okay. scores come along. Since all the 14s are shot off all of our targets now. <laughs> okay, we got. We are still going on, folks. Tommy Gomez and Levi Morgan are now tied at 500 and will shoot All one right. more arrow. Tommy Gunn Chris Hacker is at Manuel four are and tied is to the fifth at 480. And they will shoot an Tim additional arrow to see who cannot break the tie. So let's see how they, they do. McCarthy after it. All right. For the shoot-down tiebreaker, Tommy Gunn and Manuel are going to shoot their first couple of arrows for score. And if they're still tied after that, we'll go to a closest to the 12-ring measurement. They're looking at the target, which I found to be very helpful in my archery career. Right. Seeing the target first. seems like to be to one of the first in. steps to shooting the target. Nice when he's ready. Although, far be it from me to try to tell you how these guys are shooting. Clearly, they're shooting at a very high level. A uh, professional one, right. I would say. Let's start your one minute now. Ooh. I don't know if you can see this in the background, but Levi actually has a pouch sewn into his Oshkosh Bagash coveralls that he's apparently using for his release. That seems very handy. It's very smart. Uh, utilitarian, you could say. 
No Bogus, question, the, the man who won't go away. You got one more so chance. We shall see exactly what he's able to do here. Bless his little heart. Aren't you sweet? Assessing Let the me know you're ready, Tom. All right, now. we'll start your one minute now. If you notice, he actually draws his bow back before he shoots. Uh, that seems to be another key to uh, getting a target. All right, we got another 14 minutes. So the Manimal and Tommy Gun are preparing for their seventh arrow as they both hit 14s on the last one. The leaderboard looks a lot like this at this point. I would like to thank Trueball Excel for providing us with the leaderboard. Uh, I appreciate that very much. It works out very well. And um, hopefully we can have another Let's exciting round. Maybe we'll get another pair of 14s. Let's see what they do. It's very close. They're currently shooting the Havelina. It's a very difficult target to get a 14 on. And he is making the officials work for it. They are, they are looking very closely to see. They're still checking. And it's a he got, ooh, eight. unfortunately he got an eight. So now we'll have to see what, what Manuel does and what he shoots for. Will he just go for a 10? I believe so, but we shall see what he does. 14 here and the golden chip. All right, that is our winner. We've got Morgan, the manhole, got a 10. We'll try and get an interview with him shortly. Thank you very much for watching, and hopefully this has been a great shoot down as it has been for everyone here. Chops out.